Yeah, details now a year in the making almost. Attorney General Dave Yost filed this lawsuit in Butler County in November of last year. And that's after auditors in several Ohio counties, including Franklin County, found that prices on Dollar General shelves were often lower than the prices the customers were actually paying. At the same time, I did go to several Dollar General stores across Franklin County and found that to be the case. So now the settlement between the retailer and the state contains accountability measures to ensure that you are paying the correct price. Those measures include thorough record keeping, employee training, sufficient staffing in stores to make sure there's time to update the prices and make sure they're accurate. And if a customer catches a discrepancy, Dollar General is obligated to honor the shelf price and fix that discrepancy within 24 hours. Dollar General will also pay a million dollars to the Attorney General's office. 250,000 of that will go toward fines and reimbursing the AG's office for the investigation. And 750,000 of that $1 million settlement will go toward food banks or other charitable organizations specifically to get food and personal care items for people in need. The AG's office says it'll have more information soon on exactly how that money will be distributed. I'll be sure to keep you posted on that. And in the meantime, Dollar General has not responded to my repeated requests for comment, Sierra.